BIOS update on this motherboard MSI B350 PC Mate. So I'm there on that web address here on the BIOS page. BIOS from 2019 December. Let's download it. Put that file onto a USB flash drive. So insert the flash drive. Extract it to drive H. That USB flash drive is, let's see here at properties is XFAT. Let's see if XFAT is accepted. In older version it's accepted only in FAT32. So let's restart the computer and press delete to enter BIOS. Press delete a few times and the USB is there in the USB hub. So the current date is January 2020 and the BIOS is from September 2017. So it's at least two years old. Now let's go here to M flash. System will auto reboot and enter flash mode. Do you want to enter flash mode? Yes, press enter. The computer turned off, now it powered on. The flash drive is inserted, I will not press any key. Don't press delete on the keyboard. Enter flash mode. Media not found. Please plug in USB media and press retry to try again. So XFAT is not accepted. I have to format it either in FAT32 or NTFS. And exit. Now it mentioned exit flash mode and it entered BIOS once again. So just press Ctrl Alt and delete to restart the computer. Ctrl Alt and delete. Okay, so let's go to the flash drive. Get that ALQ file cut it I will paste it onto a different drive paste now format that flash drive right click on it and go to format and let's try NTFS it's not even allowing us to format it into FAT32 quick format has to be checked because otherwise it's way too slow and the allocation unit let's set it to default so NTFS default and quick format start formatting will delete everything from the flash drive so if you have something on it move it to a different partition okay format complete close it now cut this bios update file and put it back to the flash drive paste it there now let's restart the computer restart and press delete again to enter bios go down to m flash system will auto reboot yes so the USB flash drive is inserted, now the computer turned off, now it turned on and it should enter automatically BIOS. And here we have it. Now there is no error message, so NTFS is accepted in this version of BIOS. Left and right arrow is working. So on that 64GB flash drive formatted into NTFS mode, go to the right with the right arrow and there's the BIOS file. So the current BIOS is from 2017 and the selected BIOS is from 2019 December. And let's just press enter. I sure want to select this file. Yes, press enter. BIOS is updating. Don't shut down or restart until BIOS update process is completed. Notice mouse and keyboard would be logged during updating. So there is no mouse support here. Even a keyboard isn't doing anything. The LED should turn off. 44 degrees Celsius. The process is only at 11% and it's barely moving. CPU fan, BIOS, I don't know, BIOS version. Okay, so let's wait until it finishes. This is very slow. It barely advances a percent in a few seconds. Don't press the power button on your computer. Don't turn it off and don't remove the USB flash drive. So keep the flash drive inserted. This portion was much quicker. It took, 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 jumped at <laughs> that rate. Now it automatically restarted. Device is changed, CPU or memory, your CMOS has been cleared. Please enter setup to configure your system. F1 to run setup, F2 to load default values and continue. So the BIOS is from 2019, November 29.
Okay, so let's just press F2 to load the default settings. So F2 and it restarts. Windows is loading. You can safely remove the USB flash drive at this moment. The fan is noisy again, I have to adjust it in BIOS. Here on the MSI page, it says the latest BIOS is 2019 December 3. And in CPU Z and mainboard, it says 2019 November 29. 